can find the signature molecules that are in the sperm and the egg and develop small drugs or peptide drugs to them, you can come up with new strategies for both male and female contraception. I'm John Hare. I'm a professor of cell biology, urology, obstetrics and gynecology, and biomedical engineering at the University of Virginia Medical School. I'm the director of the Center for Research in Contraceptive and Reproductive Health. What we're doing is finding drug targets that are not in lots of tissues, but they're just in the egg itself. And we're developing ways to target those molecules and deliver drugs inside the egg to arrest its development. And we call this new class of drugs ovastatins. So from a contraceptive development point of view, we're always trying to dissect exactly the molecular players at every stage of this fertilization event. Because when we can find the unique molecules, then it offers us a chance at developing an interdiction. What we've discovered is a molecule that's in a region of the sperm head that is retained on all the sperm that are fusing with the egg membrane. The anterior part of the sperm head is ensheathed by an organelle that we call the acrosome. This organelle is essential for fertilization. For example, if a person has sperm that lack an acrosome, they are infertile without assisted reproduction. You can overcome this infertility by directly injecting the sperm into the egg. The acrosome is divided into two main regions, the anterior acrosome, which is seen in red in this image, and a second main region called the equatorial segment, seen in green. When the sperm first encounters the egg, the head begins to be remodeled. The anterior acrosome releases its contents of enzymes, and these help the sperm burrow its way through the vestments that surround the egg. But this equatorial segment region of the acrosome remains intact. The equatorial segment is very important for fertilization because it's the region of the sperm that first encounters the egg. Specifically, that membrane that overlies the equatorial segment is the part of the sperm surface that first touches down on the membrane of the egg. And this begins a cascade of recognition events that eventually lead to the egg reaching up and engulfing the sperm. Nature is extremely complex and yet has mysteries that when you scrape the surface are absolutely thrilling and create marvelous opportunities for new innovation.